All right, uh, today we're gonna test out the chill mode. Yes, I finally got the update. Yeah, I didn't call Tesla. They uh, they just sent it to me. I don't know, maybe it's random. But so the chill mode is like a new setting for acceleration. Uh, by default, you know, this car has sport and ludicrous, and now we have chill, which is like one step lower, and it changes a little bit of behavior. So let's see. Um, let's go on the highway. Uh, yeah, let's let's uh, let's go here. Let's go chill. Uh, so let's try the chill. Let's set it to chill, and then over the speedometer it says chill. Okay, go go. Oh, so you know what? The acceleration seems smoother. Yeah. So uh, it kind of mimics like the the, the other EVs, like uh, like the, especially the i3 has really sluggish, like from the start at least, very sluggish. Uh, throttle response so let's see okay if I try to hammer it now oh you see the power comes gradually like okay oh oh 200 kilowatts why is that max uh, let me try again okay seems like a little over 200 is maximum yeah what about ludicrous Whoa. Okay, and that's more like 400 kilowatts. Yeah, so Ludacris is a lot more powerful. Whoa! Freaking crazy, man! Woo! Shit! Okay, that <laughs> Wow, that was like... Okay, chill kind of feels like um, uh, a 60D Model X with low state of charge. You know, it, it really feels sluggish. It feels like, it feels like a fossil car, diesel, with, uh, with turbo lag. Very much whereas uh, ludicrous is yeah tesla speed is light speed no it's ludicrous speed yeah so let's try again let's go back here to e6 um but i guess if you're not too familiar with tesla then it kind of makes sense to have chill mode because there's like so much power you there's, you've seen pictures of people crashing a car into a building or something so uh, let's try the chill acceleration from from let's say uh, let's do a zero let's do a zero to hundred launch again let's see okay or zero to whatever okay, let's let's chill now wow that is super slow that is like slower than fossil are you crazy man shit okay let's try ludicrous then well I cannot do the the zero now but just take it from let's say forty or something I don't know here and then try to just la launch it kind of oh shit <laughs> oh that is a lot more yeah so in a way the chill mode will like disable a lot of the maximum power output but also it will um let me, see, let me try something okay so i want to accelerate okay wow it's, this car is so powerful so even if i just nudge the accelerator a little bit but i'm i'm pretty used to this you know so most of the time i can drive pretty smoothly but there will be times where i maybe you know push a little bit too hard and then boom the car just jumps like that 200 kilowatt output yeah instantly uh, so with the chill mode it will not allow you to do that so it will gradually increase the power output so i guess that kind of makes sense in many ways but oh. Oh, you're like, like like now. Oh, when you are in the roundabout and you just have to quickly go past, then it, it almost feels a little bit like dangerous, or you know, less less. The car feels less nimble when you want it to be nimble, you know. Uh, so you have to give up that nimbleness. Uh, I think that's the word I just defined right now. Like hi, here, you know. You want to go? Oh, oh, you can't go. You can't go. There's a car. I could have gone there if I didn't have this chill mode on oh look at that how slow it is out of the corners out of the, the, the out of from start Ooh, it is so slow but on the other hand when you have adaptive cruise control on it will cruise smoother because that was the problem with ludicrous or the normal mode is that it's like it accelerates hard and then it brakes hard and then it accelerates hard like oh yeah wifey was sick after that not because of me but because of the car yeah <laughs> yeah but um so i mean 
Yes, um, all the, also, also other people report the same thing that uh, adaptive cruise control uh, or an autopilot you know, works much smoother with chill mode. But I mean, Tesla should have you this option to configure that. Okay, when you have adaptive cruise control on, then you can choose to use chill mode. You know, uh, chill with ACC or something like that. You know. Uh, but as soon as you take over and go to manual or whatever, you know, then oh, look at it. Oh, it takes so long to get out of there. Oh. Uh, then I want ludicrous or whatever setting I have set before to be active. Yeah, that would make more sense. That would make it more useful so you can choose uh, because it's too cumbersome to like, okay, you want to go to autopilot like now, right? And then you go off and then you have to go to the menu and then switch off this one ludicrous and then next time you want to go all the pilot you have to do this again and then chill yeah so it's too cumbersome no um let's go back to ludicrous here oh yeah because i love it um and also you know you never know when you need that power you know for instance you could be just you could be driving uh you know in the city like here and then and then suddenly there's like a there's like a beamer coming like like let's say yeah there's a beamer on on your side and you'll be like oh yeah you wanna you want a piece of me you want a piece of me huh you me you me you me and you're like oh yeah and he's honking at me i'm like okay 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 and then for instance if i have chill mode on i forget that i have chill mode on and then we go right and then he wins he wins the battle i'm like no now he's gonna tell all his beamer friends that Tesla sucks balls, you know? It's, I should have had Ludacris on, then I would have beaten him to the ground and beyond. I would have sent him back to the future. Wait, to the past, of course. Yeah, fossils are in the past. Um, so yeah, I would have gone to the future. That's how it would be me. So, um, you know, I, why would you switch off Ludacris if you have Ludacris in your car? We're like, what? What? Like, it's like, a dude with a V8, he's like, wow, you know, I only use four cylinders, yeah, and sometimes I use eight cylinders, yeah, but I have to switch on the eight cylinders. Like, what? Why would you do that? You want to have uh, instant power like that? <laughs> oh shit! Oh. oh, by the way, if kids are watching, you know, don't complain to me. I, I, I don't take any responsibility. I don't make videos for kids. If you want to let, let your kids watch me, then go ahead. It's your own fault if you do that, yeah. So, you know, I mean, it's, it's not that bad. I mean, the language I'm using is not that bad. You should watch Salomondrin or, or Car Guru or watch Top Care. Top Care. And James May, he's like, oh, cock. I'm like, uh, okay, well, he's saying that on BBC. Yeah. But, um, okay, back to the chill mode. I think for people who are not used to Tesla, uh, I'm not trying to be like, I'm not trying to, um, uh, what you say, to, to, um, um, uh, what is that word again? Um, uh, I, I have to do two things at one time. I have to drive and think at the same time. Um, I, I'm not trying to discriminate. Yeah, that was the word. Uh, for you know, I was about to say that. Well, you know, chill mode might work might work great for granny. No, no, that's discriminating. But you know. People who are not used to Tesla, I would say, you know, then it kind of makes sense to have chill mode on. But uh, there is also one other thing, place you could use chill mode, which is some people say that, well, it is, it is easier to, you know, like, uh, to uh, avoid spinning with the wheels if you use chill mode, because then you, you have like gradual uh, power output, you know, increasing power output. Yeah. So that, I can, yeah, that kind of makes sense. Let's try to find a... Uh, slippery somewhat steep uphill here uh, i'm not sure if it's good now it was um it was not too slippery yesterday but now the temperature has dropped so uh, hopefully it will be slippery okay so now we have ludicrous on oh this is kind of steep oh oh should i go off-roading oh i want to go off-roading i want to go off-roading people are gonna yell at me then okay like here okay this is kind of steep somewhat steep okay so if you want to accelerate now you see, just spin, spin. Wow, okay, I have so good tires, so that's that's why I got got up this hill anyway. Okay, but um, let's let's try that again. Yeah. Let's, ooh, let's, ooh, can I can I make donuts here? Shit, can I make donuts? The store is closed, right? Do they have video surveillance here? I don't think so. Okay, 
Um, but let's see. Okay, let, let's try that uphill again. Yeah. Tesla Bjorn just playing around at night. Okay, let's let's do it here so we get a, a greater angle. So I guess let's, let's switch on chill mode now. So I guess this will make more sense if you have a rear wheel drive uh, because all wheel drive is just amazing. But if you have rear wheel drive and you want to climb this hill and then you are a little bit hard on the accelerator, you see it still goes up and uh, you didn't get that uh, that uh, uh, we call it the, the ABS. Oh no, the the, the 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 traction control lamp didn't go off. But uh, if you have ludicrous luda ludicrous right ludicrous mode, yeah yeah, it's that wrapper the the ludicrous mode. <laughs> so let's try again. Okay. The black man's mold. Uh, no, wait, 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 wait a minute. I lost a bunch of subscribers now. Discriminating even more. But okay, ludicrous mode is on. Uh, let's try now. If you want to go uphill there, and like oh, and then you hammer it a little bit too hard, right? Oh, yeah. You see, like oh, uh, let's not try to crash into that trailer. Oh shit. Yeah, but um, so I'm, I'm trying to find use for this uh, chill mode, and I. I cannot find any good use for it because you want to have all the power available at all time. Uh, so um, I don't know. It, it doesn't make sense for me, but I'm a speed demon, so maybe it makes more sense for you guys. But um, at least I've shown you how it works. So chill mode, yes, there you go. It will gradually increase power. It will limit to about 200 and I think about 250 kilowatt or something. Uh, and I guess. For, for other cars, uh, like a non-performance car, it will also limit it further down, or I'm not sure. Yeah, I haven't, I haven't to test it on other cars, but uh, yeah. So anyway, uh, that's it then about chill mode. So now I'm going to go chill. <laughs> I'm going to go chill like this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So uh, thank you guys for watching and uh, talk to you later. Bye bye.